So we've seen some projects making headlines, but these days the IO model or initial exchange offering is drawing much attention as the next fundraising vehicle. Here's a look at how they're being executed. IEOs, are they just another form of ICOs? Are investors gonna carry on investing in these things and eventually getting wrecked? With me, I've got Shacha from a company called Koti. Now, for full disclosure, I am an advisor to this company, and so we're not gonna talk about the company. All we're gonna talk about is the process of an IEO and the thought process behind it. Shacha, welcome back to Crypto Trader. Thank you so much, pleasure being here again. Shacha, IEOs, it's a big buzzword, and we've had some successes and some failures is there a benefit to doing ios what's the thinking behind it well while most people think that ios are about fundraising uh, it's actually more about marketing and, and engagement to a greater community so when you do an ieo you actually reach out to the exchange specific community and make all these people uh, part of your ecosystem. So now they are a supporter of the projects because they have a vested interest. Okay, now let's talk about the process of running an, an IEO. You guys at Coty, you raised money a while back. I know you've got a very healthy business in, in the payment sphere. What's the rationale for doing an IEO and specifically doing an IEO on one of the exchange, one of the big exchanges? Yeah, so our mainnet is, is now launched in, in private phase and it's going to a public phase. So we're going to need to uh, uh, do a generation event for all of the coins and, and list it, it, and exchanges. That's the way it goes. So we think this is a better way to do your first listing. So you're, getting, you're building some momentum around uh, your launching process. So that's one thing. The second thing is that exchanges uh, go through a very healthy due diligence process on who they want to list. And if they're doing an IEO and they're more committed, they're even doing a better screening. And you know what? It, it gives um, the little people, the retail investors, um, a fair chance in getting in to in certain prices and dynamics that only private investors had uh, access to earlier. Shaka, thank you very much. It's been Thank a great you. pleasure seeing you again. All right.